Earthworm Dissection. When you think of recycling, you may not think of earthworms. But in a compost pile, earthworms can turn food scraps into great fertilizer. And earthworms' body systems work together to get the job done. What kinds of organs are found in an earthworm and what do they look like? We're going to answer these questions by performing a simple experiment. Before we get started, remember, exercise caution when in the lab. Handle sharp items carefully and always wear your lab coat and safety goggles. Also, make sure you have your science journal handy to take notes and record results. All right, here's what we're going to need for this experiment. Gloves, a dissection tray, dissecting pins, forceps, a scalpel, scissors, probe, and a hand lens. And of course, we can't get very far in an earthworm dissection without a preserved earthworm. First, I'm going to lay the earthworm in the dissection tray, ventral or flat side down. Now I'll use the hand lens to find the prostomium. That's the lobe that goes over the mouth. And this swollen band here is the clitellum. The clitellum produces an egg capsule which holds fertilized eggs until they mature. Now, I'm going to turn the earthworm over and make a shallow cut on the clitellum. I'll spread the incision using my forceps and pin down the sides of the earthworm with the dissecting pins. Now I'm able to see the aortic arches. These act as the earthworm's hearts. I'm going to check the other organs that make up the circulatory, digestive, excretory, and reproductive systems of the worm and make drawings and notes in my science journal. Time to clean up and wash my hands. I knew that earthworms and humans have different organs, but I guess I never thought about the body systems we share. We both have circulatory, reproductive, digestive, and excretory systems. Next time I can take a closer look inside the digestive system to see what the earthworm ate. The earthworm in our compost pile at school would have helped out with some old pizza crust, some apple cores, and a whole lot of Friday's special meatloaf.